Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to screen record on your iPhone 11 on the latest iOS 18 update. Now, this method has changed from the previous version, so let's get started. First thing you want to do is go ahead and pull down the control menu from the top and then click on that plus icon on the left top corner. Once you do that, the phone's going to go into this edit mode for this menu. We're going to click on add a control and from here on you're going to look for screen recording feature or you can search it up here so you're going to go ahead and tap on that and it's going to put a new icon that looks like a big circle and a little circle and then tap anywhere to exit out of that edit mode and now we're ready to screen record so when it comes to screen recording you can screen record with sound or without sound or audio so what you'll do is if you want sound and audio you're going to long press and hold this screen record icon just like that and it's gonna pop up a menu the key thing is long pressing and holding to get this pop-up menu which will ask where you're gonna want to save your recording by default I'm just gonna keep it at the photos and then right here microphones if you want the microphone on simply tap on that and then tap in your else and now to start a screen recording session just simply tap on it once and then there's gonna be a timer and then once you start seeing it blinking red up top here, it means the screen recording has started. And in order to stop, simply tap on it again. It's going to say, do you want to stop? So you're going to stop. And then that recording will be saved to Photos or whatever app you decide to save it to. So we can open up Photos. And then we can see this screen recording we just did with sound just like that. So that's how you can do screen recording. Again, the recap is adding a control and then clicking on it to start a recording just like that and then record and then tap on again and then stop. So that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If so please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.